Give it a good clappy. Oh, clappy clap. Hey gang, welcome back to This Box Rocks. I'm sure you recognize this box. This is Unboxing the Bazaar. It's always so big when I get this box and you never know what's inside. Unboxing the Bazaar is a subscription box that celebrates the wild and wacky lesser known holidays that you may have never heard of. And that's usually true. What I, what I get, I'm like, well, that's interesting, but it gives you a reason to celebrate and it's a lot of fun. This box starts at $39.95 plus $8.99 shipping. Right now there's a promo that you can get free shipping on your first box. So check out their website and subscribe and see what you can get. Also, if you do a six month or 12 month subscription, you get you know a little bit of a discount per each box. So whatever suits your fancy there, squints. Hey buddy, wanna help me? Come here, let's go the other way. All right, so let's dig in and see what this month holds. Oh, look at that. It is full to the top here. Okay, we always get our little thank you card. Thanks a million. Okay, do we wanna, do we wanna look at the holidays? Oh, I see one that I'm gonna love. Uh, August 1st is Spider-Man Day. Oh, also, do you see my Wild and Wacky Calvin and Hobbes tie in honor of unboxing the bazaar? My husband and daughter love Calvin and Hobbes. So this is my new favorite holiday, International Cat Day on August 8th. Can't wait to see what we get for that. August 15th, National Relaxation Day. Very nice. And August 20th, National Radio Day. So did you know about any of these holidays? I don't think so. And look, this box came with a big cat. Ooh. Spence loves to help with this one. He loves these shreds, don't you, buddy? Oh, I think I see the cat one. Let's see. Oh. Oh my God, squeeze. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Is there an actual cat in there? Why are you so interested? <laughs> okay, move your booty. All right, I'm too short for this box. I see little kitty balls. Oh my goodness, what do we have here? Look at that. Oh my gosh, it is a little kitty teapot. Oh, that is the cutest thing in the world. Look at that. So let's read about National Cat Day. International Cat Day. So this teapot is worth $29.99. And I mean, come on, that is so precious. Look, Squinny Bud. Look what Mama's got. There we go. There are 500 million cats in the world, most of which hang out at my front door. August 8th was chosen for International Cat Day by the International Fund for Animal Welfare in 2002. Among the favorite breeds are Persian, Burmese, Short Hair, Siamese, Maine Coon, Balinese, Ragamuffin, Munchkin, and Bengal. Enjoy your cat and treat it like the king or queen of any jungle it happens to be living in. Suggested ways to celebrate. Share a picture of your cat on the internet. Check. Get your cat a special treat just for them for that day. Check. Give your cat some catnip and let them have a mellow day. Well, he really rarely gets a mellow day because I'm always all over him. But he is just the best cat in the world and he is the king of his castle here. So, new favorite holiday, International Cat Day. Whoa! Okay, let's see what this is. I'm telling you, this box is amazing. It's full of tons of stuff. Karaoke, Grease, and others 50, other 50 hits. This is for, I'm gonna guess, National Radio Day. Oh, it has Summer Nights, Hopelessly Devoted, you're the one that I want. Okay, I'm gonna drive my husband crazy with this, I'm sure. And it has a lyric book. National Radio Day. Try to name at least five radio stars from the past. Put on a show for your family where you are the radio host. Use your karaoke CD to sing some of the biggest hits on radio. Done. Let's see. Radio changed life forever. It allowed for new speeches and entertainment to be broadcast into homes live all over the world. Credited to Guillermo Marconi in 1894, the radio could be found in two out of five homes in America by 1931. Sometimes the radio became a little too lifelike, as in Orson Welles' War of the Worlds, where several people committed suicide rather than be taken by aliens from outer space. By 2012, there were over 15,000 radio stations transmitting around the world. So we can celebrate this on August 20th. What next? What next? There's a 
something. Oh, Spider-Man playing cards. Those are cute. This is for the August 1st Spider-Man Day. Peter Parker first appeared in Marvel Comics Amazing Fantasy number 15. Unlike other superheroes, Spider-Man did not have a mentor like Batman or Captain America. He made his way on his own via stories by Stan Lee and artwork by Steve Ditko in the shared universe. He was raised by Aunt May and Uncle Ben in a fairly normal environment, using his spider sense to combat evil in the world. Suggested ways to celebrate. Buy a Spider-Man comic book, go to a Spider-Man movie, get a Spider-Man outfit for your walks around the neighborhood. I won't suggest that to my husband because he'll do it. Spider-Man day. This is the fun one. And then there's something really big down here. Oh, wow, faux fur throw pillow in cheetah print. This is for relaxation day. Let's move the box. Chill out, sit back in your chair, or better yet, a hammock, and try to make shapes out of the clouds floating overhead. This is a day where you just totally relax. Take a break from the stress that surrounds you and calm yourself into nirvana. Let your mind go blank, think about nothing, don't fix any meals, work in the yard, or even go for a walk. Become one with the universe. Listen to the birds sing and zone out, but don't fall asleep because then you've wasted your day of relaxation. Suggested ways to celebrate. Allow no news to upset your day. Visit the beach. Don't worry, be happy. Watch a feel good, fun movie. So this is very nice. I actually got a Darth Vader blanket from a previous Unboxing the Bazaar box and it is a staple on our couch whenever we're really cold. So now we have two. What do you think, Squints? Come here. What do you think? International Cat Day should be International Squinty Boy Day. Unboxingthebazaar.com is starting at $39.95 and it's really fun for the whole family because it gives you a reason to do something a little quirky, a little out of the ordinary, you know, eat some ice cream, play some cards, listen to some songs. It's a lot of fun. I really like this box and you should follow them on Instagram because they post like other holidays that aren't necessarily included in their box. So I'm excited for our August holidays. My favorite of course being August 8th International Cat Day. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my channel and you can also follow me on Instagram or Twitter for a crazy amount of pictures of this guy and even more unboxings. Thanks for watching.